Welcome. I bid you welcome. This is my music corner of the world. John Clouser, Johnny Metal, the Metal Dad, coming to you on Apologetics April. We are talking day 12 here. So today I'm actually going to take a look at three CDs. I'm going to take a I'm going to go a little a little bit more than just the normal two here. So um this next this one I'm going to talk about today. Again, talking about apologetics, that 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 Christian parody band. Um, and they always like uh, kind of referring back to a previous album of theirs called Wordplay. So here again, we're looking at, um, again, a little play on words here. Um, this uh, CD that they would come out in March of 2013. This one's called Hot Potato Soup. Okay, so why Hot Potato Soup? Well, there's a lot of... Con they, here in, the, in their little kind of summary here there's a lot of topics out there that you that can be called hot potato type of topics very controversial so and then you get everything mixed together and you get hot potato soup so there you go um it's uh you know like when you talk about subjects in the bible and how um how to relate to them in today's world um, a lot of those biblical thoughts and feelings are pretty controversial and hence a hot potato type of topic. Um, so what do we get on this album? We get 15 tracks. Um, the band here, uh, basically the same as, uh, as previous. Uh, we have Keith Hamey on, drum, on bass again. We have... Uh, Jimmy Vegas Tanner on drums, Jay Jackson, of course, on vocals and the lyrics, uh, Tim Tensha on guitars, and uh, Todd Waits on keyboards. Uh, we also get a few uh, female vocalists on this as well. Um, another really great CD here. Uh, another one I got to uh, listen to quite a bit. Um, so who do they take on in, in this one? Ballroom Blitz by, this, by Sweet. Uh, hard to handle by uh, the crow black crows. Uh, love the way you lie from uh, Eminem by, uh, featuring Rihanna. Now, this let me just I'm gonna stop there. That parody, I've never heard, I don't think I've ever heard the original, but I've listened to their version of uh, Live the Way You Love the Way You Lie. It's called Lived the Day You Died. That's probably one of my favorite parodies by the band. I absolutely love that song. Uh, wonderful track about the crucifixion uh they do do i diddy diddy by man for man hot blooded by foreigner forget you by CeeLo green uh sweet child of mine by guns and roses i'm not your stepping stone by the monkeys pumped up kicks uh by foster the people two princes by the spin doctors you got another thing coming by judas priest give me three steps by little uh leonard skinner uh walk by the foo fighters man in the box by alice in chains and semi charmed life by third eye blind um so here again, hot subjects, hot, they're, they're, you know, again, I could probably go into a lot of the songs, but I want to just kind of give you just a, a little taste of this soup uh, to use to use the title here, um, just to kind of give you a say, whoa, wonder what, wonder what parody they did to, you know, to, uh, to, to the Leonard Skinner, give me three steps song or, you know, uh, you know, sweet child of mine, they do uh, that their track is called weep Jeremiah. So it's all about Jeremiah, the weeping prophet. You know, so you get those kind of things. Again, wonderful CD. Um, the production, again, is great. Again, also signed by the band. Again, if you got like so many copies, uh, if you're like one of the first few uh, to uh, uh, order a copy, then you got it signed. Um, next one I'm going to put, I'm going to talk about, came out in November 2013. This continued the classic series uh, that they did previously. Um where they've re-released a bunch of their um, albums, separated them by different genres, and got them all mixed and mastered to the to the same volume. And uh, there you go. And uh, you know all of those CDs are pretty much out of print now. And I think most of these classics are also out of print. But uh, they did this one called the Christmas Classics. So uh, if you got the twelve downloads of Christmas, you got most of these that are on here. One of the different ones they do though. Um, they do a new version of uh, Van Halen's Panama, uh, which was called Santa Claus. Now, 
the original version had Carl Messner on guitar. This version shows the talents of, of Tom Tincha and what he could do. And he, he nails the Eddie Van Halen sound for this album. So uh, another uh, very good one. Um, and plus, for a lot of folks who didn't get uh, Hotel Can't Afford You, which is the parody of Hotel, Can uh, Hotel California by the Eagles, this was also the first time it would be available on a CD, um, you know, after they phased out the older ones in 2010. So uh, the next uh, album they would look at would come out at about the same time as the Christmas classics. Uh, this would be just in time for Christmas. Um, this one was called Handheld Messiah. So um, the, where we get this, of course, there. this is a play on the word of Handel's Messiah. So the handheld Messiah, which is Jesus, as uh, you know, also uh, would get a moder rather modest reception as he first appears in public by being laid in a manger. And um, uh, so this tells more of the Christmas story. Uh, this is Apologetics' full-on Christmas story using different parodies. So you have uh, them taking on Desire by U2, Urgent by Foreigner, Heartbreak Hotel by Elvis Presley, Wild Thing by Tone Loke. Uh, uh, Janie's Got a Gun by Aerosmith, uh, One Night in Bangkok by Murray Head, Cats in the Cradle by uh, uh, Harry Chapin, uh, Purple Haze by Jimi Hendrix, uh, Ice Ice Baby by Van Vanilla Ice, Can't Help Falling in Love with You by uh, Elvis again, and We Didn't Start the Fire by Billy Joel. So here again, this is apologetics telling the Christmas story using these different parodies of secular bands and putting christmas type lyrics to them and so it tells the, the christmas story that way very cool uh very cool cd um wonderful again wonderful production they're just they're just they're just in at this point there's not much more i can really say about the production of the uh of the albums because the everything here is just stay it's just solid straight stuff so there you go um so again today we looked at um, hot potato soup, Christmas classics, and handheld Messiah. So there you go. Um, what do you guys think about apologetics? Uh, like, share, subscribe. Let me know in the comments. Um, you know, uh, that Christian parody band, again, using, using secular music, but changing the lyrics and hoping that it, it by maybe just a little bit will help draw people to Christ. So that's a, that's their main goal. So with that said, Johnny Metal, John Clauser, the Metal Dad from my music corner of the world. I will see you soon.